Hey, Justin Chamness here, realestatewholesalersclub.com. Yesterday, I visited with you about taking full, absolute, 100% complete responsibility for every detail of your life. Today, I want to talk to you about taking on more responsibility than even that. And that means even taking on more blame than you probably deserve. Let me give you an example out of my own life. When I first started hiring virtual assistants to help in my real estate wholesaling business, I had no idea what I was doing. I must have had a dozen virtual assistants before I found out exactly what was going wrong. It wasn't necessarily the virtual assistant. Let's imagine I delegated a task to my virtual assistant. The first dozen or so did not complete the task like I delegated it to them. My first reaction in every case was to blame the virtual assistant for their incompetence. After a dozen or so virtual assistants, I realized I needed to ask myself, what is it that I'm doing or not doing? Again, notice I'm beginning to take full responsibility. What is it that I'm doing or not doing that is causing this situation to happen to me over and over and over again? In what way am I responsible for this situation? Maybe I hired the wrong virtual assistant. Maybe I didn't give them crystal clear instructions. Maybe I failed to follow up with them to see that the task was completed as I requested. As you can see, even in this specific situation, I am ultimately responsible. Actually, most of the time, if you trace things back, you'll find out a moment in time when you could have delegated or instructed more clearly your virtual assistant and gotten much better results. Oftentimes, it's not the virtual assistant, it's you. Perhaps you could have gotten a coach, maybe gotten some advice, or maybe just had a better plan or been less complacent about following up with that virtual assistant. Right now, I want you to do an exercise, and I want you to pick one thing in your life that really, really bothers you. Then I want you to think about it until you can determine the root cause. Then I want you to decide what you could have done differently that would have made the situation turn out better. And you'll be taking more responsibility for your life and your business. Ask yourself, how am I responsible here? The truth is that nothing can change in your life until you do. If you want your virtual assistance to change, if you want anything in your life to change, the change has to start with you. Okay, make sure you complete the exercise. Pick something that bothers you and then trace it back to the root cause and then decide what you could have done that would have prevented this. You may also come up with a quick plan on something you need to do right away that will permanently and forever change this problem in your life. This is taking on responsibility, but not just responsibility for yourself, the extra responsibility of caring about what your life and your actions does to affect the lives of others. Tomorrow, we're going to talk about how luck has absolutely nothing to do with it. Real Estate Wholesalers Club is designed to help you get where you want to go. So stop by and visit us at realestatewholesalersclub.com. I'm Justin, and I'll see you tomorrow.